Chronicles is News Nation's senior story editor and my friend Paula Froelich. You're the first person I thought of when I saw this story because I wondered if you could get your spidey sources to spill the tea on which crew members got their names hijacked for these uh, alleged uh prescriptions. Okay, let's just first say I am also a huge obsessive fan of the show. It is just, right. it's like crack. I can't handle it. Um, I love it. And we do it. not know the names. Nobody is releasing them. But what I can tell you mm. is that they were on season four, episode two. So don't worry about Kate. She wasn't on that episode. It was Captain Sandy. It was Hannah. It was Chef Ben. Yes, it was Aisha. It was Bobby. We don't know if they were the ones. We do know that they had close contact with the martinis. And we also know that they spent a lot of time talking. And we know that the martinis have done this for a little while. However, it should be noted that you and I can go online and find the names of any cast member. Oh, yeah, yeah. By the way, that picture, that was Aisha serving them. And here's my guess. Oh, yeah. Here's my guess. Oh, yeah, she had no when idea Aisha what's, finds going, out what's about, about this, to happen. If she, right, but if she's found out about this already mm -hmm. or if she's about to find out about this, she'd be nice. Like, she'd be like, oh, it's okay, guys. Like, that's how her response she, would be if she found out that her I name was I actually think she'd go, oh, my God, first, and then say, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they must have had some problems. But, yeah. No, I got to be honest. Listen, like, when you hear something like this, you you want to feel because these cast members and the crew members, most of them are pretty, pretty nice. And except for the ones I listed, like the Rileys and the, oh, mm -hmm. man, those ones, forget about it. But are they going to tell us? Like, at some point, are they going to reveal who the victims were in this and whose names were used? Because I'm not sure how victimized they were, except for the fact that it's on the news. Okay, I bet that they will at some point, and I bet that the cast members have already been notified because it is a massive investigation. You not only have the Suffolk County Police Department involved, you've got Homeland Security and the DEA. So at some point, somebody had to pick up a phone and say, hey, just checking, did you order oxycodone? And oh, do yeah. you live in Long Island? Or we have you been in Long will Island? Be. Hey, uh, yeah, five no. seconds, literally <laughs> five second answer. Are they going to be called as witnesses? Like, are we going to see them on the witness stand? I mean, we can only hope, and I hope that Bravo films it. But also, BT Dubs, yes. if you're going to try and get some oxycodone, don't do a hand pres handwritten prescription. Don't. You don't do that anymore. And then when you're busted, don't, use don't a famous say, name. hey, yeah, and also don't say, hey, I'm not selling it. It's for personal use. And you're just like, oh, geez. I gotta well, run. They're not, they're I not doing that. I'm getting the hook. I'm getting the, I'm getting the hook. You know that. that. Oh. That I've entertainment so hook. Um, Paula, thank you for that. Call me when you find out or if you find out who the names are. Appreciate this. Have a good weekend. You too. <laughs> thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.